Hello and welcome. Thank you for joining us on this walk around video of our latest van to camper van conversion. Uh, this one is a VW Caddy Maxi. It started its life off as a Sky Maintenance Engineers van uh, and then we converted it over to what you're seeing is a very high standard of camper van. It's absolutely excellent. We're really proud of how this one turned out. As you can see from when we're walking around, the van is really straight. It's in excellent condition. Uh, there's no nasty scratches, no nasty bumps, no nasty scuffs on the exterior of the van. Uh, all the tires are in excellent condition. I'm just showing you what the first thing we installed, which is the 240 volt hookup. So if you're at a campsite or anything like that, you can just plug it straight in and you have no problems. Then we installed the tints on the rear window which look great, really go against the white really well. And then we installed the windows both on the left and right hand side which do open. And then we replaced the hubcaps it came with with these really nice diamond cut style uh, hubcaps. I think they look great. It's really rare for a workman's van to be in such excellent condition. There's not even any scuffs or anything like that on the VW badges. So you can tell this one's been really well looked after. It's got full service history. Uh, all the tread on the tires is excellent. It's just had its cam belt and water pump done and it's MOT till November 2021. And again, no scuffs or scrapes, even on that badge as well. It's really common to see that on the VW logos, but this one's got absolutely none of it. So as we go into the inside of the van, this is the, the best bit of it. This is what we're most proud of, how it turned out. It looks absolutely brilliant. Really nice, light and airy. You see some of these camper conversions and they can be a bit claustrophobic, but uh, with the tones and colors we used here, I think that it's turned out really light and airy. As you can see from the power sockets here, you can control all your lighting and electrics from here. You've got two USBs, a 12 volt, and then when you're hooked up to the campsites 240, you can use the two pins there. And that's just how the lights work. Like I said, really nice, light and airy. Got the fridge cool box there. We'll go into that in a bit more detail later. Here's the kitchen area. We've installed some storage and a working sink and tap. And then nice little nooks and crannies for you put your cutlery and plates. Yep, so this is the sink and operation. It can come out quite powerful if you want it to. And then all the water supplies are stored just down there and you've got a nice uh, big storage container full of water. Just to show you how the kitchen area works, you just pull out the table, nice and simple, really not stiff at all. Here's the cooker and the cooking area. Again, this is bespoke. We built this from scratch and designed it all ourselves. Brand new cooker, never been used by anyone else before. And then there's the storage area for where you keep your gas bottle. As you can see, that literally took seconds. Uh, and now we're gonna show you how easy it is to put back into the van as well. And there, just a few seconds and it's back in. So now we're just going to show you how easy it converts from a couch or a day camper into the night camper. So you simply pull out the two drawers that you're seeing being pulled out now and then take the cushion from the right hand side and just place it down. It's actually really cozy as well, really comfortable, double bed, enough room for two. Bit of storage under the couch. And then, yeah, this is what it looks like from the other side of the van. Uh, we're based out on the New Forest, so you're just overlooking the New Forest there. This 
this is the fridge. It uh, goes all the way down to minus 10 if you want. Um, it's powered off the leisure battery that we also installed. I'll talk about that in a bit more in a minute. Um, so yeah, if, if you put your bottle of wine or put your bottle of beers in or you know whatever you want for your breakfast next morning, put it in at the start of the journey and it'll be nice and cool by the end. And as we move up front, what you'll find is absolutely no rips, scuffs or tears on any of the seats are in great condition. Then you see on the odometer, just under 66,000 miles from brand new, backed up by that full service history. And the well-spec'd interior, it's got your screen, it's got the radio, it's got the sat nav. Yeah, so a little bit more about the entertainment system. You've got your Bluetooth there. You can stream your music or make phone calls for it. And you've got satellite navigation, which is excellent if you're going for a longer trip. Uh, what you see with these is the air conditioning. It's, it's very bizarre, but a lot of the VW caddies don't come with that as standard, um, where this one comes with it. Great for those Euro trips. Here you have all the electrics. You'll see on the right-hand side, the 130 amp hour AGM deep cycle battery. Uh, so it comes with a four-year guarantee as well, so you shouldn't have any problems there. And I'll leave you with another exterior shot just to show you how good condition our camper van is. If you have absolutely any questions whatsoever that we haven't answered in this video, please just let us know. We'd be happy to go in more depth of anything that we've missed out. Um, and it'd be really good to hear from you soon. Um, thank you very much for watching. And we'll leave you with a few last shots of our great camper van. Thank you. Bye.